Hey Care Crew, welcome back to another video. We are down to our last two trips here. I can't believe it, but before we get into today's video, we are at home cooking with HelloFresh. I am actually at my parents' house right now. I had my HelloFresh delivered here because I know how much my mom likes it and I was spending the week here, so I thought it'd be fun to make the meals and it's so flexible. Literally, it's great for everyone. You can have it shipped to a different place. You can skip a week if you don't wanna have your meals come that week. You can add an extra protein or desserts or change it up. Um, they have something for everyone. They have a family friendly option. They have vegetarian, calorie friendly, and I usually do the calorie friendly, but the last two times I got the vegetarian option and I really have been liking it. So this is the one I'm making today. The creamy dreamy mushroom cavatappi. It looks so good. Um, it says it's gonna take about 30 minutes, right? Yeah, 30 minutes and five minute prep time. And then it has all the steps to show you what to do and make sure that you don't do it incorrectly. <laughs> so you really can't mess up. If I can do it, you guys can do it because I am not a chef. Like I said, they have something for everyone. They even have a kid friendly option, but everything you get comes in a bag like this. And I like the seasonal packaging here. So everything comes in pre-portioned out ingredients, which means less time prepping and less food wasted. Makes it super easy to do. The other part about HelloFresh is that it cuts out any stressful meal planning. Um, you can enjoy your cooking because you're not stressing out about what to cook and everything comes pre-portioned out. Um, it takes 30 minutes usually or 20 minutes with their quick and easy options to do. So you get it on the table and you actually enjoy it because it doesn't take that long. I don't know about you guys, but I've been getting so bored lately that uh, cooking is like one of my favorite things to do. So I never really know what to cook though. So this makes it fun and easy for me because I have the instructions and I just kind of enjoy the process of doing it. Um, so it kind of gets you out of that recipe right. You get to try new things. If you guys are interested in trying out HelloFresh, go to HelloFresh.com and use my code CARRIEAN80 off to get $80 off across five boxes, including free shipping on your first Here box. Here is the finished product. I've really been liking the uh, vegetarian options. They're super good and a great way to mix it up. Hi. Yes, I do. Is it real hot? Uh, it should be okay. Oh, it's steamy. Mm, very good. So I also made a plate for my stepdad. It actually created a whole lot of food. Um, thank you to HelloFresh to sponsoring today's video. And without further ado, let's go ahead and get into this trip. All right, Carrie Crew, welcome back to our second to last travel vlog. I am on my way to the airport. I'm still able to park in the parking garage. Woo hoo! Good morning, Carrie Crew. It is 9.50 in the morning. We are headed out for a two-day trip again today. So last, we have one more after this. So that is sad and crazy, and it went by so dang fast. So today, I am deadheading to Boston. If you guys don't remember what deadheading is, you get to fly as a passenger but you get paid just so that your company can take you from one place to the next to fly a flight out of there so it's easy and then we go from boston to dallas and then tomorrow is really going to be the rough day i can't wait to have a break after this because i've been this is going to be my sixth day flying I'm finishing up my coffee and my favorite culver's cup okay should we get this day started should we do it should we do it people we got it. We're gonna have fun. I am the number two position again, as always. We're flying, I believe on the 321, and let's go and get this day started so we're not late. So now we are walking into the airport. This is outside of the Philadelphia International Airport. It was a gorgeous day out. I'm walking inside of the airport and I was shocked by how many people were in line for security. I'm waiting on the plane to Deadhead, waiting for my other crew members that I know. Here they are, so fun. Waiting takeoff. Oh, this is my favorite part. I can fall asleep to this sound. Let's just enjoy it, shall we? And welcome to a Boston Logan International Airport. I love the little sign up there. It's so cute. So we just got on the plane. We had a two hour sit. I got my Dunkin' coffee. And we have a three hour and 47 minute flight 
to Dallas. Wish me luck, guys. Wish me luck. We have landed in Dallas and Marcus is playing with this cute puppy. He was so sweet, guys. Oh my gosh, look at him. He was adorable. How do I turn on these lights? How do they touch? I don't know. I'm not sure. Welcome to Dallas. Beautiful night here in Dallas. It is gorgeous weather, absolutely gorgeous. That was a very long flight from Boston and it was pretty good. It was easy, it was almost completely full, but now we are here in Dallas. What time is it? It's 8.20 and we leave out our van is at 6.30 tomorrow morning. So I'm not doing a whole lot. Um, the crew is going to come over to my room and we're just going to talk about furloughs and fun things like that. So nothing too exciting. I probably won't vlog while they're in here because it's kind of weird. Would I be a weirdo? I think only one of them knows that I do YouTube. So I don't want to be a weirdo and be like, oh my god, here, talk to my camera. If it gets to that point, then of course I'll bring it out. But if it doesn't... For dinner tonight, I know it sounds weird, but I'm cooking up these sausages. They were a little burnt on the grill. Some salmon, an avocado, and two pickles. And of course, heating up in my Hologic Mini. I tell you guys, this is the number one thing I think you should get if you're a flight attendant or travel. I'm serious because even on the plane when it's freezing, I just plug it in and I warm it up. And it keeps me so warm. So it's kind of a weird dinner, but it's going to be really good. Eight hours later. Good morning, Carrie crew. I am looking a little rough right now, so let's try and pull this together for the day. If you guys haven't tried this blow dryer, I need to review on it. Um, these hot tool ones, I just do my hair in like three seconds. I've really been wanting to try the Dyson Airwrap one. I just can't get myself to pull the plug. So, Dyson, if you're watching, or if anyone has an extra one, let me know. Let me know if you guys love it because. This thing is great, and I just feel like the air app would be magic. So I have to be downstairs in 10 minutes, so I am gonna finish packing up here, and then I'll chit chat with you guys when we get on the plane. Early morning here in Dallas, so we are going up this long escalator and waiting for our train to go to a different terminal. We had a struggle that morning getting to the right terminal. It was a whole hot mess and it was way too early. I needed some coffee. Oh dear. Like our side gig, and I get it, but this isn't enough to stimulate most people though. Here is our Skylink taking us to the correct gate. Oh, it was so early, there was almost no one there. We waited in line at Starbucks, and my crew member was so nice, she got me coffee. Oh, I just loved her. Here's a little aerial view of where I was. We're on the plane, it's a two hour flight. We have a three hour sit in LA and then we get to go from LA to Philly. Just landed in LA. Now we have a three hour sit before we head back to Philly. Here we are waiting for the cleaners to finish up the plane in Los Angeles and head off to Philadelphia. All right guys, that's the time went so fast. We're on the plane now and the flight time is four hours and 47 minutes to get back to Philly. I will check with you guys when we get there. I'm exhausted, but we have to do a service on this one. I haven't done a service in a long time, so I'll let you guys know how it goes. so pretty I cannot get over this view and here we are end of the day ready to get home
This is kind of weird. Lighting. Okay, Carrie Crew, we are done with the trip. It was a five hour flight home. We did a service, easy peasy. The flight was not full. Um, they've been doing a good job at keeping, when they can, middle seats open. Of course, it's Saturday and I don't usually work Saturdays, but one of the crew members is coming over. I just picked up my friend Tony. Uh, enjoy the weekend. That is it for this trip. We have one more trip left after this. It's so sad, but you know, this was a really good trip because I had a great crew and that's really all that matters. So I'm going to sign off here one week i have a week off until our last trip so i'm going to rest up you guys i know i'm looking so fabulous right now but i'm editing this video and there's not enough footage uh it's only 12 minutes long so i wanted to add some more footage in here so i'm gonna put in our fall tree i know it's almost christmas but i thought i'd throw in the fall tree because so many of you guys love it um just for some extra video tape footage <laughs> I can't even think. I just, I'm on a sugar high because my aunt's making this amazing caramel cookie brittle and yeah, so I'm gonna add in that footage now. Uh, I'm at my parents' house. Today is my aunt Sue's birthday. She came with me, she came with mom to pick me up last night at the airport. But we're gonna go get stuff to make bloodies and I wanna see if there's like a balloon, maybe a card and she's gonna sleep over and we're all gonna hang out. My stepdad's out of town. So we're just gonna have a big sleepover and hang out. You wanna say hi, mom? Hey, peeps. Here for about a week, and I have a bunch of appointments I need to get done before I lose my insurance at the end of the month. So I have a doctor's appointment, I have my teeth cleaning, I have gyno, literally every appointment under the sun packed into this week. Here is our outfit. And it will probably be my outfit for the next week that I'm here. I'm obsessed with this jacket and it's just, Easy and well, I'm gonna have to share. We got Starbucks this morning, and I have to share with you guys my go to Starbucks order. I got it from Mallory Irvin on her Instagram, and it's only two points if you're doing uh, WW Blue. So, we were walking out the door. I was bringing my camera so we could go to the store. My mom said I can't videotape her until she washes her hair, and I just realized that my camera's gonna die, so I'm gonna charge it while we go. Here's the birthday spread with the birthday girl. Put your Happy birthday. Thank you. Good morning, everyone. It is the next morning around 10 a.m. I'm headed to a doctor's appointment. Nothing is wrong. I'm gonna go through this light. I just, uh, I'm getting a checkup and then I have a dentist. I have to get fillings in my cavities. I have no idea how I have cavities, but I do and I feel like because of the masks that my like I don't know I feel like my mouth is just dry all the time I don't know do you guys feel I don't know I don't know how to explain it now we wait I feel like I've been here for forever but they had me switch out from my cloth mask to this one at the doctor's office but this is good favorite shoes. Got home. Mom is putting up the tree so we can decorate it. Christy. Got for pillows. You know, you know. This is really cute. This one's yours. Yum. And then this one is mine. The sweet peppers. Delicious. And then my hot dog. So good. Look at that. Whoop last two days have consisted of so many appointments seven to be exact so I didn't vlog because it was just annoying going to the dentist twice going to my regular doctor twice the gyno labs just like everything so I did not vlog and we had dinner we had Portillo's 
It's like nothing. It feels like being home more than Portillo's. We're gonna do the tree now. So I'm gonna vlog it because you guys love the fall tree. I look a hot mess. Mom looks cute. She put on a festive fall scarf because she is getting into the theme. You Are you gonna? She did her makeup, so she's willing to be on here. Say anything, anything at all. Happy Thanksgiving. Okay, it's not Thanksgiving. Okay. Okay, take that away. <laughs> Come join us with decorating the tree. <laughs> Wait, take that away. Cheers. <laughs> what is I don't. This? I, I don't want. I'm not really good at talking on camera. Sorry. All right, so we have all of the items that we need out here. And then just the plain tree, tree skirts from Hobby Lobby. And we'll just start sticking in like the biggest, like that. Right, we're gonna. The biggest pieces. Um, and then we'll move on to the smaller ones. We're going with these gold, cause these are pretty big. Most of the stuff is from Hobby Lobby, guys. Just so you and know. Joanne Fabrics. A lot of it's Joanne's too. These are pretty big. Those are Hobby Lobby. Really pretty. So pretty. Here. Are those too close together? Yeah, maybe move that one right here so you can stick another one right there. When they're too far on the side, they look like they're creepy. Yeah, like sea creatures. Yeah. So I think it's all they have about to be playing around and seeing what works. I Just think um, throwing that out there. Sometimes they have to. Do I have stuff on my chin? What the heck? The one is complete with the white. Now we're gonna add in the gold. Please. Some bronzy gold. Gold is added, and now we're adding okay. in some acorns. Okay. Oh, do we need balls over there? Maybe up I feel like top. we need balls right here. Up on top. Yeah, I got one for here. But we need something up high over there. Cherokee found the weed. That side is seen. This side is really like straight. Right here. Uh, around. Now these are Joanne fabrics. Okay. Is white pretty in there or not? It's a little Cause, too much. Because we can bring, I like the idea of adding, starting with purple. How purple would go with the copper colors. I agree. Okay. I think that those flowers might look too spring that you just put in. Uh, yeah. But on that, does it look too springy? Yep. Yeah. I, I think they're, they're starting to get color on the sides, which you don't really see. See in the back, it's starting, they're starting to turn but you don't really see that. And this is starting to go to like... You know what you could do with that? You could put that on top and add it in with the feathers. Well, why don't we put in color first and then we can play? Okay. Because do these... I'm not saying no. Oh, I, yeah, I know. It's, it's, you gotta see it all. Good morning, everyone. It's the next day. We stopped on the tree because it wasn't... We needed to go get a few things and we ended up taking those white wooden sticks out because they were kind of looking like sea creatures. It just was not right. So we're going to Hobby Lobby now to try and find some, the way I'm gonna say this, you guys are gonna think I'm crazy, some like owls to put in it. Wooden pieces. Like wooden animal pieces. Oh. It sounds oh, yes. weird, but trust us. Masks on guys, masks on. Can we just look at how pretty these are? But these, I need these. I'm doing it justice. Look at that. Mom. Some amazing look at these. I need these. You need these. The, my mouth is dropped, just so you know. Brittany. Just per, I think they're amazing. Well, I wanted a better I mean, reaction. How would you put it, like one or two in there, but it's beautiful. They're stunning. They're stunning. It was right. not the reaction I wanted. Oh, I love these. I know that. This color That's green the is only so one green. with the green in there. Put it in the cart. They might be in the back. Oh, I have pretty Okay. Look how cute He's he is. He's so cute. Oh, his face. Here's how the tree looks right now. And these are all the items that we just picked up to add to it. 